Hello and welcome to Let's Play 2 2013. This is 2K and this is TNA episode 67. I think we're still a so oh, there's the thing. There's a solid four weeks until the pay-per-view still. Oh, Jimmy Corderas, what'd you do? Oh, you brought it down, call. Okay, great. Everyone will be drunk. Promo by Paul Heyman. Heyman announces hard core tourney. So there's going to be a hardcore tournament. Um, and the winner of the hardcore tournament is going to get a title shot at No Surrender. It's going to be like TV hardcore, not actual hardcore. But, you know, Heyman in hardcore for hardcore justice. Um, and the first round matches will all be... Or we'll go two, yeah, two first round matches tonight, and two first round matches next week. Our first of the matches. Let's see if there's a. Uh, I'm going to create a match here, where it is sort of brawl based, and there's weapons, but. You know, contact risk isn't very high. And we're just going to call it Hardcore TV. There. So, we start out with Killer Steen. Uh, going up against Jeff Hardy in a hardcore match. And Steen's going to win fairly convincingly. And then he's going to cut a promo. Um, and he is daring Austin Aries to win his match. Basically saying, if you win, you face me in the next round, and then I murder you. So really think about what you want to do tonight. Aries is then in the next match. And I forgot who he was in against, but we'll say it's against Teleule. I had someone else written in here, but... Tell you it works. And Aries gets a win after just a, a straight up Bully Ray beatdown of Tele Ule. So it's really a two on one win. And we'll just do a, a brawl backstage. As a result of that, as Tele Ule and Bully Ray fight to the back as the big dog has been eliminated. And then Aries goes to cut a promo that he's not afraid of Steen. And it's, you know, Steen is just a, a big, like he says he's a killer, but he's really just a, a pushover who can't do anything without his flunky Lee being around. So, Steen goes ahead and destroys Austin Aries in the middle of the ring, or in the middle of the backstage set. Uh, from that, we then get Samoa Joe, who comes out. Christopher Daniels is there. And they cut promos on each other, talking about how far TNA has come, how far they've come, 
Joe basically says Daniels is trying to relive the glory days while Joe is in the middle of his glory days. He is the TNA champion. A feat Christopher Daniels, I believe, has never accomplished. Let's see. Did, did he ever win the TNA championship? Nope. So, and he starts playing up the, you've never won the big one. You're never going to win the big one. You're nothing but a mid-card talent, and I am happy to be fighting you in a, essentially a bye week or a bye month, especially with AJ Styles at my side who is with me. Uh, the main event is then created of Joe and AJ versus Daniels and a partner of his choosing. So we we move on to start the second hour with Chris Jericho, and he he's talking about why he did what he did to Batista again. Batista is just a scumbag. Chris Jericho is trying to help TNA by removing the assholes who are tearing it down, starting with Batista. Don't worry, there'll be more. TNA will never, ever be the same again. Blah, 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 blah. We then get a, um, I guess, a preview match of next week. Uh, it turns out that Kenny King uh, will be facing Killer Lee. And Tyler Black will actually be facing. Oh my god, I can't believe I forgot. Oh, Batista. So Lee gets his buddy Steen, and they also have AJ Styles jump in to get some experience on this. And uh, Shelton. AJ's busy doing his thing with. Joe in the main event. I'm sorry. I forgot. And as a preview match, it goes well. Um, Black picks up the win. And not a finish, but there is a distraction. Can I just have a regular distraction? Yeah, there we are. Where Batista is distracted again by Chris Jericho. We then have a normal one-on-one -on -one match that's going to lead to a big brawl with James Storm and Davey Richards going 10 minutes and Storm getting a big win. And it looks like they might be closing in on the tag team title and they brawl to the back. With Davey and Eddie, James and Robert Rood. And we then get our main event. Where Bully Ray and Christopher Daniels are going to take on AJ and Joe. Let me just make sure there's no one better. Yeah, that's good. And Daniels actually pins AJ Styles. After the match, Tele Ule, who is incensed that Bully Ray knocked 
him out of the tournament, comes down and beats the ever-loving crap out of him. And that's the end of the show. We need eight more minutes. And I want to, because I haven't in a very long time, have a ladies match. Because I keep forgetting to do that. And let's give... Yeah. Beta one last rematch at Gail Kim. I know I kind of dropped the ball with the momentum I had with the knockouts. I have to really work on that. But it's, it is, I have no idea what I'm doing with them sometimes. Right there. Why is it Lee? This should be Steen. All right, so there's the show. Hopefully it, it runs well. Let's go. Heyman announces the tournament. That goes well. Steen taps out Hardy in a hardcore match. Okay. And he just calls out Austin Aries. That does okay, actually. You know, I probably should just have them fight more. Uh, the ladies. Um, hold on. <laughs> 